Welcome back, Best Uni Crew. It's sugar. Y'all know I'm nosy, but I know I can probably do it, but we just gonna try some different stuff today. I got some belts. I need a belt, but y'all, I don't wear a belt like I should. So I went to City Trend, and I got two belts for, what, $5? And as you can see, one is black, and one is like a rainbow color. So the one with the rainbow color, I'm just going to put my name on it. I did this, my name, with the width is like 10. I did the height 1.5. So I'm going to put my name on that one. But... That's simple. I can do that. I know I can do that. But I want to see. Can I sublimate on some glitter? I know I can sublimate on glitter. But I'm saying like. I want to see. Can I sublimate on the glitter? Like a cute little image. And then. Iron it on. So this is up here. Now. Um. Measurement wise, y'all already know how I am. I don't know no measurements. It's my first time doing it. So we're just winging it. I'm trying to make sure y'all can see. Okay. So I got some uh, glitter HTV. And all I'm going to do is see will it be long enough to cover. Now, I know for a fact that it might not be uh, enough to cover the whole belt. Which is fine, because I mean, I want it just to a certain length anyway. I don't want to, I do kind of want to cover the holes, but if I can't, then that's, um, that's understandable too. So I'm just going to open my glitter and see how long it is. So it's a no go for that, that much anyway. So I would say, from what I can get, I take, and I just leave this part out, or I can piece it. I probably can piece the glitter. But, to me, it's fine. I will try to get my mat to cut the whole thing out for me. The belt. square and I'm gonna size it to almost like the size of this mat as long as I can get it and I probably have to do two three pieces but that's fine too so I am going to get um, a square and I'm going to make the height no the width I'm going to make the width um, 1.5 and I'm going to make the height as long as I can get it on a 12 by 24 mat okay so the most I was able to do is a um, 1.5 width and a uh, by 24. I meant by 23. It didn't go to 24. I did put 24 in there and it wouldn't let me stop on 23. But I'm pretty sure you can go by like um, 23.5 or something like that. But I just like whatever. So, I'm just going to see what this gives us. I'm going to be thankful. But I really don't want to waste all my HTV. But I want to see can I do it. So, a lot of you already know I like to pull. vinyl off the plastic so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna pull the uh, the vinyl off the plastic and then I got this here so I'm gonna have to probably do another um, another height and width because of not long enough what I want it for 
probably do another piece or two and then just cut it. So I'm gonna print out another piece that looks just like that one. Okay guys, so got the image of my choice. What I did was made it big as possible uh, to screenshot. So my width is 27.12 and I made the height 4.14 or so. Just line them up close as you can. Leave a little space for you can be able to cut. And then make sure you screenshot. And then you crop it. You push done. Save to your photos. So now I'm going to go out. I'm going to go to my photos. And then it'll be right here. I'm going to go to my little arrow at the bottom. Slide my screen over until I see print. And it'll find my printer. And it'll give me a preview of how big it's going to be. And as you can see, it's showing me how big it's going to be on the piece of paper, which was good for me. So I hope that helps somebody. I got my mini press. And I'm going to line it up on the belt. At least try to get it as even as I can. And I'm just going to... Iron that little part on there. Hold it down for when I do take it to the heat press, I can press it. So, I'm trying to get it to where I know it'll be on the belt. So, I'm just going to hold it. A lot of y'all did warn me that this stuff do scratch. So I'm trying to be careful. And then I'm just going to press this part. I'm going to have to probably overlap it a little bit to make the Seems blend in. I don't know if this shit gonna come up later. I don't know nothing. So hope hope y'all can see. Okay, I'm just going to cut my images. I tried my best to leave some space in between them before I can bear the cut. Because I didn't uh, get the Cricut design space to print this big, so. Okay. Like I said, I don't care. It's my belt, so I do something with it. Okay. So we're going to make sure we got all of them lined up just right. my heat tape one two trying to tape it I'm gonna flip it over and make sure everything lined up right yeah for right now I'm just trying to hold them all together Turn it around so I can see what it looks like. So far, everything looks good. And we're gonna run with it. 
Two hours later. Seriously, what the fuck are you doing? My heat press is on 397. I pray I don't burn nothing up, y'all. This is my first time doing this now. Let me see, can I bootleg something right quick? Ooh, it's a no no. It's a no no. It's a no no. Well, that's a no no on that part. You see it? Maybe I pressed it too long, or maybe I need something else, but it's on there. I just like, yeah, because the lips and stuff in the way. But you get it. So, yeah, this is one. Oh, 
Okay, so I got a little bit on that um, belt. And a little bit of it. Fold it up a lot because I think I melt the belt in half or something. So maybe I heated the belt up too much and it like wrinkled up. Too much. I don't know. But it's cute so far. Can you see it? Okay. Um, flow. You see here, I made a mistake and got some of my um, image over here and I heated that up too much. And then right here is the glitter. It's gorgeous. But I don't, I think this is my HTV and it is. My HTV had um, balled up a little bit right here. Yeah, I know I'm nosy, so I wonder can I lift it? And try to get it back down. But no. Okay. I pulled it up. So that's the only flaw for me. Um, HTV head came loose. And bunched up a little bit. Right here. And uh, other than that. It looks good. I would say sublimate on the HTV first. And then iron it onto the belt. And I started to do that. And I should have done it. I don't know why I didn't do that. I could have just had the pieces onto the paper, but then I would have had to piece it a whole lot. So, other than that, y'all, what y'all think? I feel good. You make sure y'all come in, like, and subscribe to your girl's channel. Let me know how I did. Let me know what you think I should have did different. So far, so good. I like it. So you just you come in. Let me know what you think I should have did different. So yeah. Yeah, I have a blessing.